Hello friends, today we will learn about the minerals and energy resources in our country. We are using articles made from different metals every day in our lives, but we do not realize their importance. A student, for example, uses a geometry box, compass, divider, protractor, etc., which are made of iron found in the earth. The substances that we extract from the earth are called minerals. For example, iron ore, copper, petroleum, etc. are all mined from the earth's interior. Do you know? Diamond is the hardest and talc is the softest substance in the world. Rocks contain large amounts of minerals which are obtained through mining. This is a process in which the earth is dug to take out the mineral ores. Mineral ores are found on the surface of the earth as well as below the sea. There are two types of minerals, namely metallic or non-metallic minerals. The minerals which are hard, shiny and a good conductor of electricity are called metallic minerals. Iron ore, copper, manganese, nickel, gold, silver, aluminium, etc. are all examples of minerals. Those minerals which do not contain any metallic property in them, example limestone, dolomite, mica, gypsum, etc. are called non-metallic minerals. Coal, petroleum and natural gas are three important non-metallic minerals. Minerals, areas, iron ore, Karnataka, Jharkhand, Chhattisgarh, Odisha, Goa, manganese, Odisha, Karnataka, Goa, Copper, Rajasthan, Odisha, Bauxite, Odisha, Gujarat, Limestone, Jharkhand, Odisha, Mica, Andhra Pradesh, Jharkhand, Rajasthan. Iron ore is the most important and basic mineral and forms the backbone of our industries. It is found in large quantities in India, which is the fourth largest producer of iron in the world. Most of the iron mines are located in Karnataka, Odisha and Goa. It is used in the manufacturing of steel. Odisha is the largest producer of manganese in India and the second largest in the world. Manganese producing states of India are Odisha, Madhya Pradesh, Karnataka and Goa. Copper is a non-ferrous mineral. India produces a small quantity of copper. It is a good conductor of electricity and is used in making electric wires. The K3 mines in Rajasthan are the famous copper mines of India. Aluminium is obtained from bauxite. Odisha is the largest producer of bauxite in India. It is used to make utensils, vehicles and airplanes etc. It is found in Jharkhand, Chhattisgarh, Andhra Pradesh, Tamil Nadu and Maharashtra. Mica is a mineral made up of a series of very thin plates. Mica can be black, red, yellow or brown and is used in the electric and electronic industries. Mica deposits are found in the Chota Nagpur Plateau region, Rajasthan and Andhra Pradesh. Limestone Limestone is the basic raw material for the cement industry. It is also used in the smelting of iron ore. Energy resources are of two types, conventional firewood, coal and petroleum and non-conventional solar energy, sun, wind energy, wind, tidal energy, tides. In this lesson, we will study only about the conventional energy or fuel minerals. Coal. It is a common fossil fuel and is used for power generation and for domestic needs. Coal has many forms such as anthracite, bituminous, lignite or brown coal and peat. Jharia, Rani Ganj and Bokaro are the important coal fields. Petroleum. Petroleum is also called a mineral oil. It provides fuel for transportation, heat and lightning. From petroleum, we extract petrol, diesel, natural gas, vaseline, etc. More than 60% of its production is from the Mumbai High Region. Assam is the oldest oil-producing state of India. Oil is refined in an oil refinery. Amazing fact! Hazaria, Vijaypur, 
जगदीशपुर गैस पाइपलाइन इज 3474 किलोमीटर लॉन्ग एंड लिंक्स मुंबई हाई विद इंडस्ट्रियल कॉम्प्लेक्सेस इन वेस्टर्न एंड नॉर्दर्न इंडिया नेचुरल गैस इट इज कंसिडर्ड एज एन एनवायरमेंट फ्रेंडली फ्यूल एंड इज यूज बोथ एज एन एनर्जी फ्यूल एंड अ रॉ मटेरियल generally it is found with petroleum and is transported through pipelines to prevent pollution compressed natural gas cng is being used to run vehicles over exploitation of minerals is harmful for both the environment and the country since it is non renewable the reserves are getting exhausted our economic development depends upon energy which is needed in the agricultural industrial and transport sectors we have limited resources so we must help the nation by becoming good and judicious citizens and make an effort to conserve our resources let us summarize substances extracted from inside the earth are called minerals minerals can be divided into metallic and non metallic minerals Mica is a non-metallic mineral. Energy resources are of two types: conventional and non-conventional. Coal, petroleum, and natural gas are conventional sources of energy. Solar, wind, tidal, biogas are non-conventional.